Well, I hope you got some rest last night. Good news, calmer weather ahead as we look ahead to our Friday and for the weekend. And some more good news, not quite as humid. So those are the good news factors, elements to our weather headlines. Even though the humidity will drop a little bit for our Friday, one of the reasons it's going to drop a little bit, well, we got a frontal boundary moving through, but uh, the drier air that's moving in, but with a little bit slightly less humidity, the air temperatures will actually have a chance to heat back up into the 90s into the weekend. So the heat is actually going to build. It will be a hot weekend, just not quite as humid the next couple of days. But then once the humidity does start to return, it is late July after all, by early next week, that'll be our next best chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms early next week. So those are your weather headlines. Better weather tonight, some fog in the morning, by the way, and then we'll see that trend for some uh, better but drier and hotter weather for Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Yeah, low to mid 90s hot this weekend, at least not overly humid. And then we're looking at lower 90s with better chances for thunder showers as those dew points rise Monday and Tuesday in the 70s after seeing a break in the 60s. Again, a little bit more comfortable the next couple of days. And then we'll see that humidity returning late weekend into next week at the airport since midnight 69 100s here at Channel 10 since midnight. 2.73 inches, so uh, yes, 2.38, excuse me, since midnight, and we had 1.75 before midnight yesterday. So at Channel 10, we had over four inches in the last 24 hours. The airport had that right there. They had a trace yesterday, so that was it. Just about seven tenths of an inch of rain, quite a variance. 85 the high today, 69 the low. Oh, by the way, Doppler radar estimating right around seven inches of rain in northwest Knox County near Powell into Anderson County near Claxton. So yeah, heavy thunderstorms last night this morning. But again, after a few spotty showers this evening, fog develops late tonight and in the morning, all that moisture in the ground trying to evaporate. Once that fog lifts, we'll have better weather as we look ahead to our Friday. And again, it will be on the hot side over the next couple of days, but at least and uh, we haven't had to say this in a while, at least it's good to dry out with some sunshine for your Friday and Saturday. So the weekend looks dry. It also looks hot as we saw with those temperatures in the 90s. So here's your forecast tonight. A few spotty showers, patchy fog overnight, 71, and then hot temperatures tomorrow in the 90s, 93 for the high, but at least not as humid. Mid 90s this weekend, mostly sunny, hot and dry. Thunder showers returning as we get into the first half of next week.